o'clock, we're learning more now about an officer-involved shooting that took place after four women were stabbed, three of whom died at a truck stop on Strawberry Plains Pike. The stabbing happening just before 7 this morning at the Pilot Flying J Travel Center. The subject, or the suspect rather, in the stabbing, Idris Abdesalam, a truck driver from North Carolina, pronounced dead at the scene. We're on your side right now with live coverage for you. WAT6 on your side, reporter Kirsty Crawford, spending the day learning about the incident. Kirsty. Bo, within the last 40 minutes, TBI identifying three of the victims. All three of those victims were employees at Pilot J. They were 57-year-old Joyce Whaley, 51-year-old Patricia Denise Nib, and 41-year-old Nettie Spencer. Now, the TBI spokesperson, Leslie Earhart, says they are still working to learn the motive behind the stabbing. We do know that there were four victims altogether all of them women. The unnamed victim is still at the hospital. Uh, TBI says the Knox County Sheriff's Office was first at the scene this morning. The officer saw one woman with stab wounds outside of the store and witnesses told them who the suspect was. And the officers saw him armed with a knife in the parking lot. Officers confronted the individual who refused to drop the weapon. At some point during the encounter, one of the officers fired shots, striking the individual. He was pronounced dead at the scene. Usually the Knoxville Police Department investigates officer-involved shootings associated with the Sheriff's Office, but Knox County District Attorney General Sharm Allen says she has recently talked with Chief Thomas and Sheriff Spangler about using TBI for these investigations to keep consistency. Allen says, quote, we have decided to follow the majority of our colleagues across the state, and I will now request that TBI conduct all of our officer-involved shootings for both KPD and KCSO, end quote. Now the TBI spokesperson says that any new information they learn through the investigation will immediately go to the DA's office. Right now, TBI, you can see TBI agents are still behind me. The scene is still being processed. They have a lot to process here at this scene. Bo? All right, Kirstie, I was going to say a lot of work still needs to be done. Thank you very much. Uh, pilot CEO Jimmy Haslam releasing a statement earlier today saying today is a difficult day for the pilot company family. It is with heavy hearts that we extend our deepest sympathy to the families and loved ones of the victims. We are providing support and counseling to the families and our team. Please keep these families in your thoughts and prayers.